Hi, I'm Adele. And I'm Justin. And we're the Glitter Bots. And today we're taking a look at the Transformers Bot Bots Series 3. This is the Arcade Renegades Surprise. So it looks like we get eight of them that we can see, and then we get eight more that are kind of a surprise. Taking a quick look at the box, there is 190 or more to collect in 2019. That's pretty crazy. Um, a quick look at the package, I think it's pretty cool. The little surprise part of it is actually like a little game pad that says bots for the buttons and then up, down, left, right. And on the back of the package, I really love the artwork with some of the ones that we see in the window appearing uh, and hopefully some that we get inside. I really like this little this little shark guy. I hope we, we get him. He's cute, I like him too. This cotton candy. It's a little cotton candy, I think. And I think I saw that on the front already. And I like this guy, the little chocolate guy with the, the Konami code on the inside here. So let's get him open. Let's get to it. <laughs> so let's get the top part open first, which is kind of your traditional action figure packaging. And hopefully we'll get some more information. Uh oh, we don't want to ruin any potential surprises. So we'll pull that out and let's open this up. And hopefully it doesn't give away anything. So all it this instruction to seem to tell is how to transform the eight that we know who they are. So it tells us, looks like all eight of them on here. It's two two puffs. Maybe it doesn't tell us all of them. We probably, maybe we shouldn't look at this look. because I'm seeing characters that are not on here so it makes me wonder if these actually in here or are a surprise or if they're predetermined so we're not going to look at it too much we'll look at the bottom here which just shows you just all the crazy number of them that you can collect out here uh, i think you get eight that are predetermined and it kind of looks like you get eight more based on them showing instructions for 16 total bots here so I don't want to spoil the surprise we're going to have. Let's actually get some of them out. Okay, you go first. So I'll start with the pinball machine. And after we get done with these, after we get done with these, we'll end up telling you what the names are and stuff. But we got this little, kind of looks like a little pinball machine here. I look at the names now. Okay. It is Bank Shot. So this is Bank Shot. And let's see, how do we transform Bank Shot here? Flip these out, flip this up, his little arms pull out the side here. Here we go, on each side. And we flip his little feet down. So there's our little our little bank shot in his little robot mode. Oh, gotta straighten his feet out so he stands better. So this one is Clawsome. So he's obviously already in his robot mode, so do you want to transform him back to his little mode here? I was looks just like, guessing. Looks like you pretty much have it. They all should be relatively easy. And there we go. I guess he's that supposed was easy. to be like kind of one of those claw machines, I'm assuming. This one doesn't feel quite as obvious to me as to what he's supposed to be. I guess they show him like this in the picture, but I mean that makes less sense than seeing all the prizes on the front. So next we'll pull out this guy here. Oh, I see what he is already, I can tell. I saw him in the package and I wasn't really sure what we were looking at with his little robot mode. Which one is he? This one? Yeah. Driver Ted. I can see he's got a little motorcycles for oh. feet, so he's kind of one of those That's interesting. little arcade games. Let's see, I assume, do we 
Maybe we need to have these open first. Put his arms up. Collapse them in. And there we go. Now he's a little two-player motorcycle arcade game. Did, he, did they say the feet slide out at all? They do. There we go. Now it makes more sense. There we go. He's a little two-player arcade motorcycle game. I like him. He's pretty cool. Mm -hmm. I know you're dying to get some cotton candy. Yeah, this one's cute already. And this is Tutu Puffs. Twist. Twisting. Oh, look at that little face. Is that all it does? No. No. Flip him over and it looks like his little stick will be on his hat. Oh. That makes more sense. My nails are too long. Here. I'll... Transform them. I'll take that. Let's see. Sometimes I know the little kind of vinyl they're made out of can make it hard to slot things in here. Is that all? Is that mm -hmm. his whole transformation? There's two two puffs. I like them. I like them a lot too. <laughs> so up next we'll go with this guy. So looking at him in the package, I could not tell what he's even supposed to be in his robot mode here. He is a roll of tickets. Roll of tickets? Okay. His name I was, is Greed Feed. I think he was, I thought he was like a token or something, but I can see the tickets now. Oh yeah, you can see it uh, in the way it's molded. I assume he's fairly basic. It's kind of a, an ugly robot though. It just looks like, like mush. Like greed. Yeah. So let's go ahead and fold this closed. And that's it. Do they slide? They don't? Oh, okay, because these are the tickets that are coming off the mm -hmm. roll. Gotcha. I like the detail of the lines. I like roll. it. But he's my least favorite we've opened so far. Oh, I skipped one. Eyeballing that popcorn. Mm -hmm. I know you like popcorn. So who is this? This is Nozzle. Mmm. So oh. he looks like he's. Is that all? That was that was great. Uh, pretty much, yeah. It's flip his head around. He's got some arms. Yep, flip him ninety, and that's it. Just turn him around. <laughs> <laughs> I like him now. Like I like the the very expressive face that he has. Mm-hmm. All right, so I'm gonna save you the popcorn because I know you like the popcorn. Thank you. So we'll get this guy out. And he is... Old cool. Old cool. So he's just kind of like a old school arcade game, I suppose. So let's see, we got his little hands tucked back here. So I assume they're gonna come out. Whoops. Rotate his little hands down. Rotate his feet and does he? Yeah, there we go. Like that. Not bad. Could have used a little more detail, I guess, on the eyes to really kind of pick him out, but I, I think he looks good. Mm -hmm. He looks better in the instructions sheet uh, in terms of how visible the eyes are because it's like it's a different yellow almost that they used for the instructions. Like the shading of this line. Yeah. Yeah. That too, it's yeah. It's more like a face. But I like it. Still cool. I still am calling old uh, Greed Feed my least favorite. Mm -hmm. And this is Cackle Corn. He's laughing. He he he. <laughs> and then he looks simple. Does he have feet? Form? Did or they? Oh, they might have got pushed in when we were pulling him out. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So he's pretty straightforward. 
I like these. Squeeze I them like, together. I like the simple transformations of them. They're just yeah. kind of fun to switch back and forth. I like that. Yeah. So, who was your favorite that we opened here? If I'm going to pick out of these eight, I think I've either got to pick Notzel or the, uh, what's the, 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 Two 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 puffs. Two two puffs. I think those are my favorite. Uh, probably leaning towards two two puffs. I like Notzel, two two puffs, and Cackle Corn. We should, even though we don't, even though I don't know about you, but I don't like Greed Feed as much as the others. He should still I, get. I like Should it. still get featured. Yes. <laughs> should. Okay. So should we get on to the the surprises? Sure. And let's see. If these are the other eight that are shown on the instructions, they'll be a little disappointing, but I guess I understand them not wanting to pack in eight more sets of instructions. Uh, so well, I'll do the you, the bots, you do the arrows, that sure. sound good? Or you wanna do the bots and I'll do the okay, arrows. Okay, that makes sense. We'll do it that way. Okay, so you just kinda. Oh, at the same time or one at a time? You can do one at a time. So I can tell already, it is gonna be the eight that are on the instructions. Oh. So what is this guy's name? Lace face. Lace face. Okay, so obviously he's a football. And looks like we open up his little laces. And then the arms should, maybe we can open that more. The arms should pull out here somehow. I don't know, I might not have nails enough for this either. There's an arm. There we go. And then pull his little feet down a little. And then what does it say? Spin him? Spin him. There you go. There's Lace Face. Like his little expression. He's not bad. Mm -mm. He's probably one of the more intricate ones in terms of things that needed to be done. Your turn. Okay. Next up. So let me see what we're getting. I was trying to make it so I couldn't see them all. That's okay. I so wouldn't this, surprise myself. This looks like his name is Skills Punk. It looks like and he's what is a little, that? I think he's a little cartridge for, you know, like your old school Nintendo. You got him going on. Pull the head, pull the arms out, and flip his feet. There you go. That's Skills Punk. I like his little too cool for school glasses. Mm -hmm. Very 80s. <laughs> too cool to stand. He's, re he's <laughs> relaxing back here. We'll see if we can get him standing later for a final picture. Alright. So I guess this is good because you know if you get this set, you know kind of which eight you're, or which sixteen you're gonna get. So this looks like a piece of pizza here. Uh, is he fully transformed or partially? Tra oh, okay. From the back, he's a pizza. From the front, he kind of looks like he's already a robot. He is Deuteroni. Deuteroni. All right, Deuteroni. We just flip these down. Whoops! Popped off his little leg. It's okay. We'll fix that. Just a little ball joint here, so no big deal. There we go. And his hands come out and down. And there we go. A little bit hard because of the angles of his, his pizza. But there's there's our little deuteroni. Let's get him in focus. There we go. I like deuteroni. I like, I like his pizza form. Yeah, me too. This is Papa Click. I like it a lot. I love the colors. Mm -hmm. I actually think from an older Bot Shot series, I may have the same camera, but he doesn't look nearly the same. Taking out I'm just thing. pulling stuff. Okay, so we're gonna take the his. Uh, Here yep, we go. You pretty much have them. You pretty much have them. Pull the legs down a little. I don't know if you I guess they are pulled down. 
Yep, that is Papa Click. Uh, you can bring his left side down, so it's like he's got his hand in here. That's fine. It's fine. Whichever way you want. That looks menacing, like he's got a big mm -hmm. machine gun arm. <laughs> Alright, up next. We've got... Sheriff something, I think. Sheriff Sugar Feet. So he's a powdered donut? Yes. I assume. So it looks like, I know this one well because I've actually got the Sprinkles donut in my office. Maybe I should get him so we can, can see. You just pull these down, which don't pull super far down. And these open up and then you spin his face. This is a lot easier than the uh, Sprinkles donut mm. though. And you and can see. Sunglasses on. Yeah, and it looks like he's got two faces on him for the instructions. The powdered donut, or the sugared sprinkled donut only has one. Does he? Let's see. No, it doesn't look like he does. Am I, did I see it wrong? Like, doesn't yeah, it look like he's got... Yeah, this is just showing pink. Yeah, okay, maybe they're just showing... I guess they're just showing how you spin it or something, because it looked like he had a red face and a blue face on the instructions here. And at the end, I'll pull the other donut from my office just so we can see. Okay. This is Sweet Cheat. Oh yeah, it's the guy with the Konami code on the inside. That's cool. So what is it? The Konami code? No, I mean, what is what Oh, I'm what holding? is he? I think he's a, a chocolate bar. Oh, now I see that. So you pull his chocolate. You pull his chocolate up, and it should reveal his head. Give it an extra, extra little tug here. Oh, well, that is that is. Oh wait, they they said pull the chocolate, but you just pull the wrapper. Oh. Yeah, that's what they said. I read that wrong. So I'll let you take back over here once his little chocolate wrapper is up. You pull his little arms out the side. Small. And then flip his little feet. Okay, this one's complicated. You got it. There you go. So that's sweet cheat. Does he have the uh, the box art shows the little Konami code on it? I kind of does he does he have a little thing that opens anywhere or no? That's just for the box, I guess. Yeah. Yeah, it doesn't look like it. That's a shame. That would have been a cool little detail to add. But it's okay. So this is... I think, Chilla Gorilla. Okay, so he's obviously... I mean, maybe not obviously. It's not really the word to say. But he is a pair of headphones. Not sure if that's, here we go, I guess that's more clear now. A little pair of headphones with Autobot logos on them. That's cool. Mm -hmm. So what do we do? We flip his little face up. Oh, I like his little face. Okay. <laughs> I really like this guy. I think he's cool. Flip his little hands out here. This one does not want to flip out the same as his other hand. Just kind of wants to go back in, but you get the idea on that little gorilla guy. And our last one. Was that tape this measure? This is Tangry Tart. Oh, it's like a lollipop? Yeah. I see. Kind of looks like a key. It does. So it looks like you just kind of split the the stick and little feet come out the bottom there. And then you fold his arms down like you did the last time and you got his face already. You should just... Oh, they yeah. come out that yeah. at the bottom. There you go. I like him too. Mm -hmm. Like his expression. 
So the one thing that kind of gets me is just the donut here, Sheriff Sweet Feeder. Was that what his name was? I think that's I think what so. it was. Uh, is he's just kind of a less interesting version of this one here, which was a Series 1 bot bot. Um, I don't remember what his name is, but uh, yeah, I just think the overall design of this guy with all the different colors is just more interesting than... A much tastier looking donut. Much tastier donut, that is definitely for sure. <laughs> so, of all these guys here, obviously we have them opposite of how they came out of the package. Do you have a different favorite than you had previously? I still really like cackle corn. The popcorn. I also like, um... Nutzel? Nutzel. 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 One of those. <laughs> and this one too. I still... And those were all three in the the main yeah. part. Yeah, I would say kinda... Kinda looking at these guys, I would say that I still like these two the best. Um, they're, to me, they're the most interesting. None of the ones that were really hidden in the package really leap out. I kind of like... Yeah, I like that one. I like this guy because he's kind of looks like he's got a big personality with the way they painted him. Um, if I was picking a favorite of the new, of the eight we opened, I would say it's him. Maybe him. I don't really like the the headphones necessarily, but I think the gorilla is kind of interesting to look mm -hmm. at. Um, but I still think that one of these two yeah. probably is my favorite of the whole thing. My favorite from one that I couldn't see would be the camera. The camera? What was its name? Papa Click. Papa Click. So there you go. So until next time, we're, we're the, the Glitter, Glitter Bots. Bots.